doing a review on the ISH D651 for the Acker Hondas that I have in my um, Acker TL. Um, I have it wired in to the factory head unit. Um, it also has Bluetooth, USB, and auxiliary. Also, this is the newest one. It also works for the iPod and iPad and things like that. Now, a lot of questions that people asked me, well, a lot of people asked was, does it work with your cell phone, the Bluetooth? Yes, it does, but you would have to manually go into it and into your phone, into the settings, and then click on Bluetooth, and then click on the gear next to the Bluetooth for the car, and click on phone audio, but on the tablet, like say if you have a Nexus 7 like I do, uh, this uh, unit, the Bluetooth unit will connect for both. Right now I'm running the USB, what I did was I, I ran it through the dashboard here into the glove compartment here. And I actually have the headphone jack here and this is a reset button to reset the, the unit. I'm actually right now, what I did was, I actually drilled a hole here. I actually have, right now, as you can see, I'm playing a USB stick that I have plugged in, a 16 gig USB stick. And it tells me the song. Probably have about 300 songs on the USB stick. And it shows me the songs. Now, they don't have directions when they tell you how to do it. They don't have direction how to go to different modes. So I'm gonna show you how to do that also. Um, if you need me to show you a tutorial how to install it in the TL, just you know, write me a message or you know, leave a comment. So basically, um, when you're using this, you're using it through the XM. So basically, you press on the the radio, and then when you go back to XM, you turn it, and it see BT means Bluetooth, satellite, radio, auxiliary one. That's for like the jack and the uh, USB, aux 2, there's nothing in aux 2, the iPod USB is when you plug your iPod into the USB, and then it has the iPod Bluetooth, like say if you're using a Bluetooth from your iPod, and then there's the USB stick right now, that's what I'm using right now, so the Bluetooth, the USB stick, when you do the streaming of the Bluetooth, um, I'm gonna show you, it just says, um, when you're streaming Bluetooth, it just says streaming on the screen. It doesn't tell you the title. But I think you can see the Bluetooth when you use it with your iPod. You should be able to. But right now, I'm just using a USB stick. A 16 gig USB stick with music on it. And the names of the songs come on. Right now, I'm booting up, um, booting up my Nexus 7 right now to show you how the Bluetooth sounds. It sounds good, but then when it gets to the high pitch notes, it kind of crackles a little bit. And then it goes back to regular. But that only seems to happen with my uh, Galaxy S5 right now that I'm recording with. It only seems to happen with that. But the, the Nexus 7, the new one that I have here, it doesn't seem to have that problem. Also, um, if you have any movies on your tablet or anything like that, you can, um, it'll play everything like that you have. Like if you have Netflix, Pandora, anything, you can stream it to the car wirelessly without any wires. So right now I'm going to show you. I'm gonna go to uh, Pandora, and I'm gonna switch this. So I'm gonna click on AMFM. Then I'm gonna move back to the XM. Then I'm gonna go to Bluetooth BT. So this is the regular Bluetooth. So right now the Pandora is booting up. So it just says audio. Pandora's loading. It's just the eye simple, it's connecting. Usually, 
doesn't take this long to connect, but, you know, sometimes it does. But, like I was saying, yeah, before, um, you can, uh, do a lot of stuff. You can, so, you can also, so let me show you the options, like, of what I was explaining to you. Um, the settings, uh, you go to settings here, you click on Bluetooth on your phone or whatever it is, and then it has the device. And then it'll have a little gear right here. A little gear right here showing you exactly how to, you know, if you want it for a Bluetooth phone audio or Bluetooth, you know, audio for something else. Um, this is just a quick video just trying to show you exactly and then, you know, it, it'll work for everything. Netflix, you know, Pandora, everything will stream directly to the car and it'll say audio, it'll say streaming here on the unit. Um, I don't have any idea exactly why it's not connecting right now, but, uh, okay, it's connected now, so, just connected, okay, so now, uh, go to gear, see the Bluetooth, it says iSimple connected. Then it has this right here. This one will say media audio. The phone will say media audio. And it'll say uh, phone audio. Phone audio is for phone calls and media audio is for streaming. So what I do is I have my Bluetooth set. So it'll uh, Bluetooth audio. Uh, the Bluetooth uh, phone calls will go through the factory head unit. And then the media audio will just go through... Uh, go through the factory head unit also but it'll only be using the iSimple for the media audio so I'm only using it for the Bluetooth streaming so I'm gonna show you right now I'm gonna log into Pandora right now it's being stupid but it says audio Let's see it says streaming streaming audio right now it's loading up Rick Ross. I don't know why it's taking so long. Put on the 4G LTE. My Wi Fi doesn't seem to be working too great. There you go. So, right now, this is YG playing on Pandora through the unit. I'm that nigga with the plugs. I'm the nigga who the homies that be selling drugs. I'm the nigga on the back street. So it's that streaming audio. So then I jump out of this. And the Pandora. Say I have movies on the tablet. Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift I have on the tablet. And uh, close out this. I got Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift on here. That I'm playing through the head unit. So it works for Pandora, it works for movies you have on the tablet, it works for everything. Um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. Oh, I'm going to show you how to go through the mode. Go back to the regular mode. We got Bluetooth, satellite, AUX1, AUX2, iPod, USB, iPod, Bluetooth, USB. And Bluetooth. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask.